This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. For Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. I appreciate every single Aries out here. From my cross watches, this energy can't be resonated, so just be a little aware that as you're tuning in. I do feel like we got some cross watches in the house right now. Somebody just kind of trying to understand Aries a little bit. For a lot of you, this could be an air sign. This could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Today's Aries match is going to be Aquarius. I appreciate every single Aries. Thank you for tuning in. I am still doing two for five questions for Aries. The cash app is D-E-E-F-O-N-D-E-L. The email is Derek Fondell at gmail.com. I am still doing quick email readings for 10. Also, if you want to talk to me on the phone, 25, FaceTime 30. Somebody could be dealing with a Scorpio. Somebody could have a history with a Scorpio, maybe. I'm seeing conclusions are coming within reach if you're dealing with a Scorpio right now or a Gemini. I'm seeing a lot of my Aries is getting answers that they've been manifesting. A lot of you are manifesting answers when it comes to something. I'm seeing you hold your vision. Your emotions could be running high when it comes to a Pisces. Somebody could be dealing with a Pisces or a Gemini right now. You could have one of these signs in your charts. Somebody could be dealing with a Cancer as well. We have a personal issue reaches resolution. So for a lot of my Aries, I'm seeing some of you will be getting through an insecurity. I'm seeing this is something that you fear. We work through your fears. We got a little bit of Scorpio energy. For a lot of my Aries, this is going to require doing something that you're going to have to step outside your comfort zone. Something that makes you a little uncomfortable. Something that you're not really used to. We got a lot of cancer energy. Somebody's definitely dealing with a cancer or you can have a history with one. You could be around one, maybe. We have you and your loved ones are safe. We got some Taurus energy. Your dreams need a practical plan. So for a lot of my Aries, is just chasing a goal right now. I'm seeing strategize a little bit better as far as how you're going to execute this goal we got a new start coming for a lot of my areas especially for those of you looking for new career opportunities or looking to start a business i am seeing this happening for you really soon for right now nothing is yet set in stone maybe because you haven't really applied that pressure just yet but i do see this happening some of you need to release somebody's energy we have what do you need to release so for some of my areas it would be it would serve you better to go ahead and let go of somebody's energy. This could be a Virgo for some of you. We have this time to rather give than take. So for some of my Aries is right now, let's give back. Let's give back to the people that's giving to us. For my Aries is out here. I, somebody's dealing with a Virgo. I'm getting that. You could be married to a Virgo or have a history with one. We got the world. Somebody could be 21. So for a lot of my Aries, I'm seeing that you are now ready to take on the world. I'm seeing you do things that... You haven't did in a while. Some of you are doing things that you didn't even think you could do. We got the King of Pentacles. So my Aries men, I mean, this can go both ways, of course, masculine or feminine. But my Aries men are doing really good financially right now. I'm seeing or you're going to. This can, of course, go both ways. This could be a man coming in with some money for some of my Aries. Maybe you are the man with money for some of you. I'm seeing a single dad. Somebody's a single dad. Somebody's a single mom. Somebody's a single parent in general. I am seeing an overnight change. We got the King of Cups. He's very in control of his emotions. I feel like this is my Aries' energy in general, period. The King of Cups, definitely for sure right now. We got the Ace of Wands. I feel like you're manifesting. A lot of you are manifesting a new life, a new start, a new beginning. I'm seeing money be presented to you. It's almost like it's going to be put in your hand. We got the Nine of Pentacles. So for some of my Aries, it's almost like... This opportunity that's coming up for you, this money is literally going to be like placed in your hand for some of you. It's going to be that simple. Somebody can have a 10-year-old, maybe six, maybe eight. I'm seeing happiness come in for you, especially for those of you that aren't that happy right now or maybe just have a lot going on. I am seeing that come in for you. Somebody can have a nine-year-old. Some of my Aries is out here. Maybe eight. Eight is going to be the lucky number for Aries. We got the Ace of Swords. I feel like this is definitely my Aries' energy right now. Just prepare for whatever comes their way, but not in a hostile way. Just more on guard, reserved. This could be you, especially if you just entered a relationship recently. Somebody could be dealing with a Capricorn. We got some Capricorn energy here. Lead a past behind. So for a lot of my Aries, some of you are holding on to a past with a Capricorn or a Gemini. I'm seeing it'll serve you better to let this go. Some of you, this is a Gemini. We got some Aries energy here. Somebody could be dealing with another Aries. We got work through your feelings. So for a lot of you, you could have some really intense feelings towards someone. This could be a Libra for some of you. Somebody could have a history with a Libra. 
dealing with a Libra right now. We have a lot of Libra energy showing up. Somebody's definitely dealing with a Libra. We have known that you are love. So for a lot of my Aries, if somebody's dealing with a Libra right now, and I'm seeing that maybe you need to see this from this Libra, possibly. I appreciate every single Aries. Thank you.